Hi, I'm Pat Wimberly, Technology Director for the Texas Association of Realtors. Welcome to Texas Realtors Tech Tips. This is part two of a series of videos about ZipLogic's Digital Ink, covering how to send your documents for digital signatures. Let's dive right in. With the transaction open that you'd like to send, click on the e-sign button in the file tab, then click on sign. Select the forms which need signatures on the left side of the window. You can reorder the forms using the arrow buttons on the right side of the forms list. When you're done selecting the forms, enter your name and email address, if it isn't already entered, and then type a message for your recipients. There we go. Unselect any role that you do not wish to include in the signature process by removing the check marks next to the role. You can also use the Enable Disable All checkbox to change the status for all roles in the list. As a note, it's no longer required that you select a role on this screen. However, if you do have a role selected, it is required to fill out the information for that role. You can additionally pull your recipient's contact information directly from the address book by clicking on the Address Book button. To take it a step further, it's possible to add roles that aren't listed here by clicking the Add a New Party button. This is a bit more involved, so if you need assistance with this option, please visit support.zipform.com where you can obtain further detailed instructions. This also applies to the Verify ID column, which provides additional third-party signature validation for a small additional charge, but is not necessary for a legally binding contract in most all cases. When finished, click on the Send Now button to start the signing process right away or click the Continue to ZipLogic's Digital Link button to get to the ZipLogic's Digital Link dashboard. In the ZipLogic's Digital Link dashboard, you may add outside documents for signatures and start or stop the signing process. You will also get a preview of the forms which are the designated signature fields. For more information on how to add outside documents in the ZipLogic's Digital Link dashboard, please visit support.zipform.com. I'd like to thank you for your time and attention. Stay tuned for part three of the series, how to send your documents for digital signatures in Digital Link, a member benefit provided by the Texas Association of Realtors. For additional support using any of your ZipForm products, please visit support.zipform.com where you can search frequently asked questions, training videos, view live webinars, or request a return support call or email. Additionally, you can call the ZipForm Texas support line at 800-383-9805. Thanks again, and look for the next Texas Realtors Tech Tip coming soon.